everybody wants to be a somebody, so it seems. So many people want to be the star. They want to be on the stage. They want to be out front. They think that's what will make them happy. But Jesus said, blessed are the poor in spirit. In other words, happy are the nobodies. Uh, To be poor in spirit has nothing to do with how much is in your bank account or how many uh, followers you have on social media. Actually, being poor in spirit is talking about your attitude toward God. Here's here's, uh, another way to translate this. Happy or blessed uh, is the person who sees his or her actual spiritual condition before God. And what is, what is our actual spiritual condition before God? Well, I'm spiritually destitute. Um, I, I'm in desperate need of God. That, that's, that's the facts, Jack. If you, want to be, if you want to be a happy, a contented, a blessed person, it starts with knowing about yourself. Blessed are those uh, who see themselves as they really are, spiritually bankrupt. Jesus also said, blessed are those who mourn, for they shall be comforted. Here, here the idea of mourning is being sorry to the point of being sick for our sin. It's mourning over our sin. It's grieving that sin. You see, when we see our condition before God as sinners, but it isn't a hopeless situation. There is a Savior who died on the cross for us and poured out, and poured out his life for every sin we've ever committed or will ever commit in order to pardon us and forgive us. The Bible says godly sorrow produces repentance, 2 Corinthians 7, 10. So, so we must say, Lord, Lord, I am a sinner, and I'm sick of it. I am so sick of my sin, and we come to him. And if you're really sorry for something that you've done, you'll change. The sorrow the Bible talks about is being sorry enough to abandon living in your tiny kingdom of one in preference for the kingdom of of God himself. You see, God, his holiness, and the life that he wants us to live is what Christ came to bring. And we have, we just have to see how far we have to go. We might as well be told to pole vault the moon if we're going to do it by ourselves. That's a, that's a trip right there. Blessed are the happy are those who mourn over their condition and accept the promised offer of peace and rest in Christ.